work I've got here is work in progress, really, and it's based on an idea I had when I was teaching some students. And I wanted to teach them about artificial intelligence and the kind of work I did, which is looking at the representation of animal and human behavior and how we interact socially. And it occurred to me it would be interesting to do something that wasn't about conflict, which is what I've done previously. I've done work about predator-prey relationships. So I thought, just crossed my mind, it might be interesting to do something about bees gathering nectar. So what you see here is a, it's a representation of how bees behave, but from a very naive point of view, not based on proper study of how bees behave, really. And the reason I do this kind of thing is because I got into doing abstract work that derived from the work of systems artists. But I didn't like the way you understood the systems artists' work. All you got out of it was a bit of math, ratios, proportions, which excites a lot of people. I find it interesting. But I wanted to come up with something which was more universally of value to human beings, and I think that social interaction, whether it be of human beings or animals. And I'm really interested in how we orient ourselves in society. How do we place ourselves? How do we make sense of the complexities of the universe we find ourselves in? And I try and explore ways of representing complexity in a manner that people can become confident, actually enjoy the complexity of life and interactivity, the messiness, the unpredictability, the uncontrollability, the sometimes controllability, the whole rigmarole of the whole thing. And that's really what it's about.